there are two ways to utilize the visualization system on the SQAV. Samples can be viewed in a standard testing capillary. They can also be viewed on a wet mount using the SQAV slide adapter. To view samples in the SQAV testing capillary, insert it into the upper visualization chamber with the blue stopper facing up. You'll now adjust the blue focus knob in order to find a clear field of view. You now have the option to view the sample up to full screen in vSperm. To open a large real-time view of your semen sample in vSperm, select the video option third from the top. You now have the option to click at the top, Real-Time Video. This will now display the sample that you're currently viewing on the SQAV and provide you the option to save it as a video clip or take a picture of it for archiving. You also have the ability to freeze the image, activate a counting grid, copy a still image of the sample, and adjust settings as necessary, such as brightness, contrast, color, and sharpness. To capture an image of your sample, select Save Picture, the bottom option. The system will now ask you to choose a file name. and click Save. The system will confirm that the image has been saved. You also have the option to record a video of the sample by clicking Save Video second option from the bottom. Again, you'll name the file as you choose and click Save to begin the recording. The image is now being recorded. We generally recommend 10 to 15 seconds in order not to fill up the entire memory. Stop capture. Discontinues the recording. And the system will again confirm that you have a clip of your sample saved. Another way to utilize the SQAV visualization system is with a standard 1 inch by 3 inch lab slide and a wet preparation. In order to do so, load a slide into the included slide adapter. It slides in from the front, goes under the small ball bearing, and clips into place in the back. Now, using 10 microliters of sample, Place a small drop about a quarter of an inch from the front of the slide. It's important that you pay attention to this spacing as that will represent the viewable area inside the SQAV visual chamber. Now, place a 22 by 22 millimeter cover slip over the drop. Allow to sit for about one minute to let the sample stabilize. Now, insert the slide adapter with your prepared slide into the visualization chamber as shown. Make sure it's pushed all the way in and is nice and secure. If your image is out of focus, adjust the blue focus knob. The SQAV also has a zoom feature that allows you to zoom in to 500 times magnification or zoom out to 300 times magnification. When zoomed all the way out to 300 times magnification, everything you see on the screen will represent 1 million per ml. This, of course, requires you to prepare the slide correctly, as stated before, with 10 microliters of sample on a 1 inch by 3 inch slide and a 22 by 22 millimeter cover slip. 
If you want to count your sample using the visualization system, an easy way to do so is by opening the video tab in vSperm. This will give you a nice large field of view. We'll click on real-time video and the image will be displayed. We now have a handy feature available that allows you to access a counting grid. Again, everything you see on the entire screen represents 1 million per ml, but the grid can make it simpler to count. The slide adapter allows you to change fields of view by turning the silver knob. When counting, you should select random fields of view and count at least 200 sperm and divide by the number of fields viewed in order to get an average. WHO 5th edition manual instructions should be followed for any manual count. This concludes our overview of the SQAV visualization system. If you have further questions, please email us at service at mes-llc.com or visit our website www.mes-global.com and remember it all started with a sperm.